uh, what are the extremes of ages? Bala and Rudha told, what is the range of uh, age in which samprash can be advised? Usually, where we can give palaprashana or even to the anaprashana. From that age onwards, definitely we can uh, join a prasha. So that means maybe from the age of one year onwards, definitely join a prasha can be given. In, in that everything is like dose dependent and con condition dependent. Uh, Chavana Prasha has been said that it should be taken in such a sense that it should replace your morning food. If we are living in a such an era that um, Agni is a quite challenging one and we cannot simply say that for the people to consume that and may not be able to digest that much quantity also. So that's why we have shifted from that to 5 grams to 10 grams dosage. One more point here, sir. Uh, the ability of the child, already the age group uh, uh, Guru sir mentioned, right? When the child is able to take the palas and other things, we can give chan prash. The ability of the child to swallow such medication, even without being guided. Okay, so that also should be uh, seen. So because uh, many kids, uh, many children, so of particular, even uh, one, two years age group, they uh, they cannot swallow the medicine properly. People, ha uh, kids have problems uh, swallowing tablets, even half a tablet, swallowing it wa with water and all those things. So, so suddenly, if uh, the children are not comfortable, it may choke in the throat. So we need to monitor in the initial doses and see the ability of the child to swallow that particular medicine because it is in the form of a paste. It can stick to the throat. Uh, we should see the comfort zone of the child. So initially, one, two rejections, we should probably wait and then reintroduce that medicine, be it or any other uh, uh, sinus which are in the form of Avaleha.